Okay. Are we rolling? We're rolling. All right. This is a video talking about harvesting seeds from purslane. This might look a little bit big to you for purslane. That's because it's a cultivated variety. Um, not sure where I got it from some seed company. And as opposed to the wild purslane, which is much smaller. But so to harvest the seeds, you can see these pods come after the flowers. Um, this one's already busted open, and if they've busted open already, that's okay. And the way I, I get them is I just dump them into this little plate I have. And then you can also go around and you can find ones that are just about to bust. And like this one right here. I don't know how well you can see that, but that way you get a whole lot more seeds. Let's see if there's any... And there's another one. You just dump it. Kind of pinch it a little. Sorry about the dog. <laughs> but, and I, I haven't figured out a way to really do this on a bigger scale. But this is pretty efficient. Um, it definitely gets enough seed for personal use. And maybe a little bit extra. Okay, so here's one that's just popped open. We'll get a good look at this one. See, and there's some in the top there too. And there's usually a lot. Oh, see that one's busting. And I'll just try to get it all, just shake it all into the collection dish. And then you you can know, don't try too hard to pop these because if you try, if you got it one and it doesn't really want to go, then you're gonna have that and there's not really anything in there you might get a bunch of immature seeds at best but you'll definitely know if it's ready because it'll pop right off oh now see that one popped right off but those seeds are all brown which means they're no good but right next to it we see a bunch one that popped and those are all black hopefully you can see that all right and so I'll try to just get the black seeds in my collection plate and discard the brown ones. Ooh. And it's kind of difficult to tell when they're going to be ready because they don't really turn a color. By the time they've turned a color, they're going to pop on their own. They stay pretty green. So you just kind of have to go each day and just test them. That one had a mixture of brown and black seeds, so I probably won't even grab those. Here's a good one. And as far as separating the chaff, is really easy. Because the only real chaff are those green leafy things, the bud ends. And they just pull, they just pick them right up, right out with your fingers, no problem at all. If you have any questions, feel free to comment.